It's three out of three for Indian Space Research Organization as ISRO was able to guide Chandrayaan-3 spacecraft successfully into lunar orbit without any technical glitch. Well, the similar feat was achieved by Chandrayaan-2 four years back and by Chandrayaan-1 15 years back. Now, ISRO gave this information on its Twitter handle where ISRO tweeted that the insertion was carried out successfully into the lunar orbit by retro burning which is in fact done to reduce the velocity at the perennial point which is very important because that's the closest point to the moon for 30.5 minutes at 7.12 pm late Saturday. Now the ISRO has also said that the next manoeuvre will actually be carried on August 6 that is on Sunday somewhere between 10.30 pm and level 30 pm. Now that will again be an important phase for the Chandrayaan-3 spacecraft as well as for the ISRO. All this is fine, but what is next for ISRO and India? Well, the next 17 days will be very crucial for India as the ISRO is expecting in that the Chandrayaan-3 spacecraft will now be performing four important orbit manoeuvres, including that of Sunday's manoeuvre. Now, while after all this is achieved on August 17th is when the ISRO is expecting in the Vikram and Pragyan to separate from the propulsion module and then right after the six days is that is on August 23rd is when the ISRO is expecting the soft landing of Chandrayaan-3 on the south pole of the moon. Now right after that is done the ISRO will then see to it that there are all scientific experiments that will be carried uh, by the Chandrayaan-3 in fact by the uh, lander and the rover there and provide all the crucial elements the information back to the ISRO which will help the ISRO to achieve this milestone as well where the Earth's life life-like elements will be read by the ISRO. Now, yes, that is again very important for uh, ISRO because India has been waiting for a long time now. But if this really successfully happens, then India will be the first country to have done a soft landing on the south pole of the moon. And then again, and India will be the fourth country to have landed successfully on the moon. Now, the Indians have all cross their fingers and hoping that this all happens successfully and they can celebrate that big moment as well.